Welcome to Mandala Moments, a daily thought-provoking, soul-supportive moment of inspiration and love with Raven. When you are joyous, look deep into your heart and you shall find it is only that which has given you sorrow that is giving you joy. And when you are sorrowful, look again in your heart and you shall see that in truth you are weeping for that which has been your delight. Written by Khalil Gibran. Out of the ashes, I can find a joy that is so passionate and realized that it is reflected in the dying embers as they fade away. Out of the rays of the jubilant sun, I can see all of my sorrows dripping like raindrops under the blue sky's watchful gaze. Life is a mirror of opposites, always glad to reveal themselves to the other for witness and reflection of itself so that expanded efforts can blossom like a lotus does from mud. It is true that in the river, I find purity and cleansing as my anguish purges in its currents for the trout and the river bass to gorge upon. Heartbreak can bleed within the flowing rushes of water, slapping and looping on rocks so angrily that clean prana floats up to greet my heaving lungs. All that exists cannot exist in a vacuum of itself. Even perfect strangers can make friends with the wild winds of others so magnificently different than themselves because it is not the outer field of illusion that we measure ourselves by, but the inner spirit and field of energy that draws us to our own expansion. At least that is how this life is when we open the doors to ourselves for revelation and this celebratory ecstatic exchange of knowing. Every part of our lives is a simple or complex reflection of something other than itself to give contrast and clarity of truth. For most people, denial of self is desired as they indulge themselves in fear born from a mysterious place within that urges avoidance over being overcome by inner knowing and witness. Fear a static frequency of chaos, then when met with diminished insight and a trembling focus, shivers in the unknown darkness like a small child whimpering rather than soaring on the wings of true knowledge and love. Fear or openness, or the friends made between these two opposing forces, allows one another to be a witness of the other in order to gain knowledge, awareness, and to grow at incredibly quickened speeds if the cascading movements of the self is acknowledged well. Now please do not grow anxious with darkness because the light stands in testament, exposing the presence of darkness to be considered. And both are equal and of equal value and importance. It is the same with sorrow and loss that seek celebration to rise like the wings of an angel lifting the fall into joy once again, in time, when one is ready to dance in the spirals of such sweetness. Respect is vital when mastering the clamoring bells of transition as the mirror of opposites reveals the sacredness of their inner splendor to each other. Without one, the other could not exist by appreciation, nor can it be explored with value and relationship within the whole. Surrounding these exchanges where opposite energies commingle in order to facilitate higher awakenings within is the quantum consciousness of allowance, longing, and love. Holding all expressions of inner offerings, love sculpts the outer webbing to allow the exchange of knowledge to occur in the safety of its embrace. Love is the magnetic frequency that lifts all moments to incredible possibilities. Even within the echoing ruminations of mirrored walls, 
Love lifts the stars and all that is sublime to find promise and expanding growth in the reflective qualities of opposites, and yet, simultaneously, friends. If you like what you hear, please be sure to like this video, leave a comment below, and let me know what you think. Subscribe to my channel and go ahead and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. See in the description how you can support my channel to grow bringing you the best content that I can. Thank you so much for visiting and for your support. This is Raven White Dove, signing out while rising in love.